Welcome to Guns and Chicken Strips. I'm your host James. What's happening? Today we are going to be going fishing with Senor El Lunkers again. And there are some random crutches on the ground in the middle of the yard. There. I have no idea why those are there. But we are getting ready. Getting in the truck. We're going to roll out to a very small lake that I grew up fishing. But a good lake. Who knows if we're going to catch anything. I'm going to do my best to listen to Senor Lunkers. Maybe do some of my old style. You never know. You just never know what's going to happen with guns and chicken strips. We will see you at this lake. We're going to stop and get some breakfast. Some sandwiches. And then we'll be on our way. Small pit stop on the way to the lake. I'm going to try a sandwich that... I've been wanting to try for a while. If you've seen my episode, I believe it was the chicken strip loophole. My mouth is watering over this chicken sandwich from Jack in the Box, and I've just got to have it. Yes, can I get the bacon and egg chicken sandwich, please? What else for you? Uh, medium Dr. Pepper. You want anything? And that is it. Bacon, egg, and chicken. Uh, bacon and egg chicken sandwich and a medium duck pepper? Yes! 680, thank you. Thank you. Hey, hey, hey. How are you? Good, how are you? Thank you. Jam, jelly, or ketchup? Nah, it's alright. Mm. <laughs> that didn't sound good at all. <laughs> what was that? The sidestep, the oh. ice hitting it. Here's a nice gentleman. Have a good one, thank you. Thank you. Is it grilled or fried? Fried. Unhealthy. As unhealthy can get. I like grilled. I like fried. Fried all day. <laughs> Dude, that looks so good. Look at that. Insane deliciousness all in one little wrapped up package oh, wow. and to the three of you that sent me pictures of these I appreciate that because now it's time yep. so good this is so good Me and Senor Lunkers made it to the the boat ramp. We are waiting on another fellow to come pick us up so we can do some fish on. Let's go slay some fish. On the boat, these two fellas, Jason, Lunkers TV, they'll both be in the description. He was nice enough to come pick us up from the dock and let us roll with him for a while. We're gonna try to get on some fish. I'm sure they will. I'll probably just end up back here looking like an idiot, but it'll be a good day. Out here with Robert. Chili fish, chili fish. Two minutes or so? You been out here? Yeah. We've been out about 30 minutes. First fish, technically. First fish, 30 minutes. We know they're here. Of course, Lunkers caught it. I'm still back here cruising. He's, he's, he's all against throwing a, uh, any sort of flipping anything today. Jimmy's back there doing his thing. Who knows what in the world I got a good there. Texas rig flipping going on. All <laughs> <laughs> oh, right. I don't know why that was funny. Because I look cool you're flipping and what you have on. Dude, I do, I deal with what I got, okay? No, I'm not, I'm not with you. <laughs> with, with you. Hey, he wanted it. Did he? Yeah, he wanted it. That fish wanted that bait, let me tell you what. That's what makes me feel better. I was kind of second guessing myself since I've been here in so long and what they were going to eat. That was quick. That was nice. He's got on fish number three. Alright, it's time for moving bait. Ah, that's a good fish. I'm going to flip him. Flip that sucker. Ah, oh, nice. Oh, well Alright, time for moving bait. 
I've never caught a fish on this lake that big. Really? There we go. Not a bad one. Eyes messed up. Good looking fish though. Good color on that fish right there. Nice fish. All right, time to move to a moving bait. We said we said we said uh, three fish on one kind of bait. Then we're gonna switch because I caught one on that. He's got three on the moving. I, on the other hand, I'm going to stick to what I'm doing, like a genius, <laughs> this beast. Oh. <laughs> I don't want to show you all up, you know, because... Alright, so Senor Jason up there at the front has now caught four fish in a row on a chatterbait. So we are all switching up to that and going to try to get us some of this action this is how you do it when you don't have a GoPro <laughs> <laughs> what you doing back there <sighs> you scared me <laughs> I was trying to make it look like a GoPro <laughs> Got your GoPro going? On? Yeah. Good watch, go. watch. Yes, sir. Watch this. I'll show you. <laughs> Make y'all laugh at me. That's how you do it, though. Like this. Check this out. Nice trailer hook, too. Trailer hook. See? Get this oh. action going. Who needs a, who needs a Boom! Look at that. Look at that. No, now that's going to be a sick shot. That dumb, that dumb bait you were using as a text on your Texas rig? Right? Yeah. Put it on the back. Ooh, chair. nice. Good idea. That's one of the reasons why we were laughing at you. These guys, these guys are still up there steadily catching fish. I'm just chillaxing back here, sitting down, taking videos of myself. <laughs> it's good I think, times. I think he's giving up on life back there. I haven't given up on life. I've given up on standing. <laughs> but you gotta realize this being this big beast body with all these muscles, Sometimes it takes a toll on your back. Standing there just does not agree with you. So sitting down is where it's at right now. Still fishing, but I'm sitting down. Giggle all you want to. I'm comfy. Jake's got him a nice size fish coming in. Holy crap. Ooh, there we go. You want to get the net or? Yeah, yeah, I got it. <laughs> I'll get the, the scissors out of there too. Alright, there we go. Boom! Yes, sir! Yep. How we like them? Yeah! Woo! Look at that one. There you go, dude. Yes, sir! That's a good five, at least. Yeah. Thick one. <laughs> nice! <laughs> There's a keeper fish for here. 18 plus inches. Oh, yeah. There we go. Job. Well, we we're about to leave today. We, we were, we were, we're just, just about to leave. Stuff. Now I can make some more casts. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm up off of my lazy butt, and it's time for some more homemade GoPro action. Good cast. <laughs> Got it real far there. That was a good cast for a. Homemade GoPro. It's expensive GoPro. Yeah. <laughs> Stick fish. Oh no, it's head shaking. Oh man, it's moving. It's swimming. Oh, it's swimming. It's swimming to the bottom. Stick fish. Like Look at that oh, stick fish. Oh my god. It's a beast. Oh, it's so big. Oh, I don't, I don't know what to do with myself. God. Oh, That's you got off. No. Oh. <laughs> Relax, 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 relax. Oh my god! You're an idiot. Dude. That was a 10 pounder. What were you doing? That was a 10 pounder. You, you should have grabbed him. You're kidding me, dude. Are you insane? Don't blame that on me. You need to calm down. Don't blame that on me at all. That was not my fault. Get up and fish. Get up and fish. What are you doing? That was literally a 10 pounder. What are you? That was dumb. You knew that was. You knew what you did was dumb. I didn't do anything. You he literally lift. jumped. You I didn't lift. lift him there. Okay, so there's nothing I could have done there. You, you know that. Boom. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yep, that was Don Well, Lunkers and Jason are up there at the front slaying them. I'm back here chillaxing, 
fishing in true guns and chicken trip style with my spin setup spinning setup that one goes out to Lunkers. We're off the lake. Go to Academy, get some stuff. Miss JP Outdoors, nice enough to take us out on his boat. Even though I pretty much just hung out most of the time and they caught fish. Uh, if you want to, go check them out. And now, we're gonna go to Academy. You got DP? Yeah. Yeah, he got me hooked on these cookies. I'd never thought about cookies from Academy until I went with this dude. Uh, I've been thinking about these cookies since I was in the water. <laughs> Made it back to the Lunker's crib. Sitting outside prepping tomorrow. I'm going fishing again with the champion. Just prepping my tackle. Get my tackle all nice and prepped here. Prepped. Done. On the other hand, we got Mr. Lunkers over here with his ridiculous amount of tackle. Ridiculous amount. Same. <laughs> Which is nothing. In the side of this boat is probably three times that. That's just what he took with us today. And he's gotta have his bag of peanuts. Tell me a secret, bro. Um. I had my first car for two hours and I drove it into a wall. It's a good secret. That is a good secret. What kind of car was it? Mazda. Why'd you drive it into a wall? A hydroplane. <laughs> <laughs> you hydroplane. I did, yeah. It was raining real bad and I just slid off the road and... Well, that's a good one. Yeah. <laughs> can't beat that one, huh? I can't beat that one. My first car, I didn't wreck it. My second car, I didn't wreck it. I haven't wrecked any of them yet. So we'll see. On that note, I would like to thank you, the viewers, which is the reason why we do all this madness and fishing and good stuff. You are the reason why we do what we do. We'd like to thank you for watching Guns and Chicken Strips. And we hope you enjoyed this episode. And as always, see you tomorrow.